All right, here's a scenario. Question somebody put to me. They just got a job, their first job as a Python dev, so they wanted to know what advice, Steph, what advice can you give me so I don't get fired from the job? What can I do to be appreciated at his new and first development employment opportunity? I'll translate that into non-business nerd talk. What do you do so that you shine at your new job as a first-time developer? Well, I've touched on this in previous videos, communication skills, being somebody that they can count on, somebody that gets along, somebody that they can speak to is a huge part of the job. When you first get into the game, there's an expectation, especially since you're a new developer, unless, you know, hopefully you didn't lie on your resume and claim to be some super advanced nerd. But when they first bring you in, there's going to be an expectation of a ramp up time. You're not going to know everything. Even if you are an advanced nerd, if they have a piece of software, I don't know if you're working on a team, on a SaaS, on a software as a service that they're providing to the public, or maybe you're just developing from scratch different projects. If in the first example, you are working on a team that's developing on their own internal software, there is going to be an expectation of ramp up time meaning you're going to have to get to know the code base and that could take time depending on the complexity of software. Even if you are an advanced developer, you, it's not your code. You're going to have to learn it. So if you're new to the game, this is your first job, there's going to be that expectation of ramp up time. So what you have to do is you have to be very uh, good with communications, make yourself available. And in the first little while, go out of your way to make sure you, uh, you try to quickly, as quickly as possible, learn the stuff. Don't kill yourself. Don't, you know, get all sweaty and uh, nervous about it. But ask your coworker, the lead, say, what do I need to do first to help so that I can get up to speed so I can help you guys out and, and do my job properly? And do that. They should tell you. Uh, be sure to double check your work. Make sure you don't make any uh, silly mistakes. And... Communicate and listen to people. That's a big part of it. Uh, in the beginning, you have to expect, as I said, there is going to be a ramp up time. You can minimize that with good communication with your team around you and with your lead. Uh, ask questions, short, concise questions. Don't ask super long-winded questions. Keep it pithy, to the point. Pithy is just a fancy word that means keep it short. And you do that, you communicate well. And, you, uh, and if you're assigned a, a task, uh, make sure you get things done on time. If you find that you're having difficulty, don't be afraid to ask questions. Don't ask too many questions, especially questions that you can research on Google. Ultimately, they're hiring you f to get the job done. But there could be some design issues. Uh, there could be some specifics with regards to their particular software, what they want to have done. Hopefully, they'll be able to provide that for you. But just work with people, listen, and that is like 90% of it. So to summarize, good communications, short, easy to ask and answer questions. Don't ask questions that you could answer for yourself on Google. You know, how do you do this with Python or something to that effect? And, um, and listen and also... Keep to your promises, you know, keep to your promises. If you're running into trouble, ask early on. Don't wait until the deadline is two days away. Ask early on and most people will be more than happy to help you. And uh, there you go. Again, this is your first job as a developer. There is going to be an expectation of ramp up. And hopefully you didn't lie in your resume and said you were a master nerd and they, they're going to figure you out pretty quickly if you're not. But uh, if you did my web stack course or you're, you're way ahead of the game, as many people have told me, they, they found out once they got the job. But uh, there you go. That's pretty much it. I hope that helps.